In his reply to the opposition's no confidence motion, Prime Minister Modi turned the tables on Congress MP Rahul Gandhi, who alleged that the centre had murdered Bharat Mata in Manipur. He reminded the Congress of the atrocities perpetrated in the Northeast under the party's watch, particularly the 1966 Aizol bombing. March, March 1966. This day, Congress has been in Mizoram and अपनी वायु सेना के माध्यम से हमला करवाया था और बड़ा गंभीर विवाद हुआ था कांग्रेस वाले जवाब दे क्या वो किसी दूसरे देश की वायु सेना थी क्या क्या मिजोरम के लोग मेरे देश के नागरिक नहीं थे क्या क्या उनकी सुरक्षा ये भारत सरकार की जिम्मेवारी ठीक नहीं थी what the Prime Minister was referring to, we need to go back to the 1960s. A relief organization called the Mizo National Famine Front was formed in 1960 after the outbreak of the Motam Famine in the Mizo Hills district. After the famine ended in 1961, the word was dropped from the organization's name and a political outfit called the Mizo National Front was floated. MNF founder Lal Denga became a central figure who caught the imagination of the masses. Things went up a notch in February 1966 when the Mizo National Front's armed wing, the Mizo National Army, launched Operation Jericho. Their aim was to remove all Indian forces in Mizoram. By early March, the MNA had overrun the Aizol Treasury and Armory and was at the headquarters of the Assam Rifles. The MNA had also captured several smaller towns south of Aizol. So the MNF decided to declare independence for Mizoram and a 12-point declaration was signed by Lal Denga along with 60 others. Indira Gandhi was faced with this massive revolt a little over a month after becoming Prime Minister. Her solution was to send four fighter jets of the Indian Air Force to counter the insurgency. On the 5th of March 1966, the planes took off from Assam Tezpur and flew over Aizol. They used machine guns to fire at the town and dropped incendiary bombs. The air raids only intensified the following day, triggering panic in the city. 13 civilians were killed, thousands were forced to flee, and large parts of Aizol were completely destroyed. This was the only time that the Air Force was used to attack Indians in India. As for the MNF rebels, they retreated and fled into the jungles of Myanmar and present-day Bangladesh. According to Prime Minister Modi, Congress hid the truth about the operation because Indira Gandhi denied the air raids. 